15 cents into dollars. Besitos to you ladies. How you doing? It's me, your sponsor, Lizette Perez. Love you guys for watching. Please try to watch this training video. Listen to it in the car. Uh, whenever you have some time when you're driving or whatever is usually when I listen to some training So it's kind of effortless for me. Um, I just wanted to talk a little bit about What you're doing maybe what you should be doing some motivation how to find the time um, Just some basic thoughts that I've had Recently that I've been wanting to share with you and I haven't really had a lot of time Mia Mia has been home from the hospital um, Only a couple weeks now maybe a few I'm kind of losing track and um, believe it or not, she's going to go to school Monday for the last two weeks of the school year. And she's been out of school since November. So it's been crazy busy for me. And I wanted to point that out because I know everybody's busy. Everybody's working or messing with their kids and doing, you know, the mommy stuff, the wife stuff, the work stuff, the school stuff. If you're in school, I get it. Okay. Um. I'm, I'm super busy with appointments for my daughters, therapies. I constantly have people in my house, nurses. It's really hard for me sometimes. Um, I want to do videos at least two a week, you know, one a week, one for training, one for my YouTube channel, which if you're not following my YouTube channel, it's at cents into dollars. So find me cents into dollars. Look that up. And, um, you know, I do stuff for my customers there for YouTube and training videos. So, um, I, again, just some basic thoughts. Um, I know we have some newer team members. And at this point, you know, you've probably had a launch party or a couple parties. Or maybe on the basic, uh, the most basic level, you've had some orders placed. Or maybe you're, you haven't. Maybe you're kind of stuck right now. That's fine. We all get stuck and we all get out of it. But to do it, you got to do some of the basic job duties that Sensi has laid out for you, okay? So maybe it's a good time to check out your starter kit. Um, if you got the product training guide, whip that bad boy open and look through it. If you need some motivation, your catalog could do that for you. You know, get to know the products. You know, get to know the business. Everything is in your catalog, Okay information on our body line on our diffusers the most basic stuff that the customer needs the the customer needs to know is right here okay so if you have nothing else but a catalog with you look through it read it read the fine print you know just fall in love with your catalog and the sense we have six months per catalog season so we're still let me see when did we change march Yep, March 1st, March 1st and September 1st are the dates for the new catalogs. So March, April, May, we're ending the third month. You know, we're getting close to the end of the third month. So we're at the halfway point of the summer season. The summer season is a way more productive season catalog, I think, and in a sense, than the fall winter one. And the only reason why I'm saying that is because this stays true the whole catalog season where in the fall winter catalog you have your holiday scents included okay so once january comes the holiday scents you know are probably not going to sell as much right and um they don't tend to have holiday stuff in the catalogs that tends to be in the they'll do um a holiday brochure and they'll do flyers for that so it won't be in the catalog so you don't got to worry about christmas tree warmers and that kind of thing in here but the scents will still be in here so that's like maybe half of the scents you won't be able to sell come january and february before march 1st the good thing though is that since he always has a plan they usually do um bring back my bar in january so um if you don't know what bring back my bar is it's um since that retire and go away so that's another thing about the catalog season i'm gonna point out really quick um half of the warmers half of the scents go away per catalog pretty much half i mean that's not a, a you know a direct number 50 percent. but um the reason for that is to keep it fun and fresh our classics tend to stay um our cafe scents tend to stay they might be a change or two um but like the new releases tend to go away 
they might make it into the catalog the next season depending and um the holiday scents obviously go away such as the spring and summer goes away for the fall time so um six months is a lot of time to promote this one catalog don't just say it oh it's the same boring catalog no it gives you time to share this with your customers it gives you time to um not just share it but you know to get to know it and do that early on we're at the midway point you got three months with this catalog you could do a lot in three months okay don't let this sit around your office area or you know just on your table in your kitchen collecting dust get to know your catalog bond with your catalog because if you bond with your catalog you're going to bond with the products and it's going to show when it's time to share with your customer okay and it's just looking through it every so often look through it every day you know remember why you joined sensi you want to earn some extra money you like the product maybe you want a discount on the product maybe you want to earn incentive trips i know i'm working my butt to earn an incentive trip i haven't earned one yet but i've gotten not close close but like the first time i got i think more than halfway point i was like oh my god i could do this <laughs> so i mean it didn't happen but um it can happen and then there was times i earned other i earned another incentive in the sense that i did everything i was supposed to do um but then i had a new recruit that i just had to help get to the 200 dollars mark to get um what's it called i forgot active and she failed to do so she just decided oh not this month i'm like no i need you to do this month so i can get this incentive but it didn't happen and that's okay because there's going to be plenty more to come cat earns an incentive every damn time she has earned uh, uh an incentive trip with every i mean i think every year she's been with the company and now she's with the company about five years i think um cat's been kicking but she's my sponsor she is our director um she ranks as your director she's a part of we're a part of her team team icebreakers which i love that name because that's what this business is about breaking the ice with people relationships meeting new people um finding ways to work your business um so if you've joined sensi and you're kind of stuck and you don't know what to do do the basics again what are some of the basics handing out this beloved catalog you know getting the sense in people's face some things you can do is carry two three four of these around and when people you know bring up a candle or a gift need or you know they think something stinks you need sensi jump in and say it you need sensi it's true though <laughs> you know um anytime somebody slips around me because you know i'm pretty sure i have those friends who i'm around and they're like okay let's that's gonna mention sensi but when it ends up being their fault that i mention it because they bring something up and um i'm not the one that had to be pushy you know because scents and smells are part of our life Stinky smells, good smells, all kinds of smells, right? I mean, people might bake a, you know, be baking in the house. I'm like, damn, that smells like sugar cookie or whatever. Sorry, and I see Scentsy in color. I'll see something that that reminds me of the color of Bonfire Beach or Strawberry Swirl, like that kind of pink. And it's just so crazy. Like I know people think I'm nuts at times, but you know, it's passion. Your passion shows, and my customers see that and know that and appreciate that. And um, I, I think, you know, if you guys chose me as your sponsor, you saw how serious I was about this, right? So um, brand yourself, branding yourself, not just in, in what you wear. And, you know, um, I take a Scentsy purse with me, you know? Yeah, I love Michael Kors. I think those are pretty and all that. But you know what? Michael Kors ain't getting me a paycheck. So I will carry my little Scentsy purses around. <laughs> that's just me personally um <laughs> so you can share your michael kors mother's day gifts or whatever um uh, but yeah just you know branding yourself has more to do with than like what you wear and all that it's just how you represent yourself as an independent consultant how you run your business how you show it how you share it okay um don't be scared to do that you know don't be scared of being pushy it's not that you're being pushy, it's you're doing the basic job duties, you know, and people gotta respect that of you. They're gonna see the entrepreneurship in you and they're gonna respect that and they're gonna understand it. And they're not gonna flip out every time you bring up Sensi. And you know what, if you do get that one person that goes, I, coño, Cynthia, shut up, or Jessica, ja, 
you know that's okay then you know your role with them okay there's three labels you can give to your friends your family and the new people you meet in your life they're either gonna be a customer a party host or a team member I'm not saying that I look at everybody and that's what I do you know I I don't do that per se but when it's time to do that if it comes up for me um, then yes some people I got to figure out who's gonna be a team member a customer or you know just the party host you need all of them in your life right so maybe write out your list of 100 like sensei instructs us I've done that I'm not great at doing all the steps and following everything perfectly that sensei asks and requires us to do in a sense when I say require I mean the suggestion of you want to do good do this you know throw parties it's a party business um, Kat never threw parties she I could count on probably one hand how many home parties she has done she has did successfully in her business if I said that right by basket parties and I don't even think Facebook parties um, so don't think that it has to be home parties all the time however when you do a home party make the best out of that bitch like kick butt take the opportunity to ask people your party hosts if they want to join it's the best time you're gonna have to ask them and I know how it is I throw parties and I've gone to people's house I've had one-on-one -on -one sessions with people and it's like okay I don't want to push it too hard because they've invited me in their home or they're just here to smell but ask if you get a no it's not a big deal um Sensei Kusun says all the time if you watch some training videos you've probably heard them say go for the no and when you go for the no it puts you into practice in what you should be doing in your business don't be afraid of being rejected you know don't be afraid of being pushy and you don't have to be pushy but you just have to be direct you gotta you gotta do what your job entails you know I used to do telemarketing as you know or may know I'm in radio still um, these are all jobs that have also helped me for Sensi talking you know preparing myself in little ways like that and I'm sure you've developed job skills you know and whatever your profession is whatever you have done that can help you in this way too we know how to talk on the phone I'm pretty sure all of us at one point has answered the phone for a company hi this is blah 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 how may I help you whatever it is whatever it is you do you've done maybe you don't answer phone calls but someone comes in hell your boss when you got to deal with your boss you got to be presentable you got to be in work mode you got to be a certain way you can't just be however you want to be because you have a job to do and a part of that job is to represent the company so represent yourself this is your business this is your job to represent yourself i can't run your business for you I can't look up everything for you, figure everything out for you. I'm your sponsor. I'm here to help and guide you. Um, excuse me, but, you know, I can't fully run the show for you. I, I can't do it for you. You have to do you. You have to figure out what works for you, what gets you parties or customers or returning customers. Um, you got to run your business your way. And that's. An awesome thing because you have control um, in saying that yes you run it your way but don't leave everything for last minute plan this is the type of business that you have to plan three months in advance and in the beginning of the catalog season plan out the six months the best you can and it's not it doesn't have to be this big plan you could do that in like less than five minutes okay what can I focus on in January and that's gonna alter too because of our specials <coughs> excuse me but you could go, okay, it's January, we have the $49 joint special, maybe. We have double party host rewards, maybe. And we usually have Bring Back My Bar. So what are you going to promote in February if you've promoted all this in January? In February, maybe is a month you focus on products. In March, go back to focusing on um, recruiting. 
you know, and giving people the opportunity to see information about joining and talking to them. Go back to, you know, par partying one month. Now we got bingo games all over online that you can find out about with mystery boxes that you can find out about. If you want to ask me about them, do so. Um, I'm working on getting with boxes out myself. I'm working on doing a bingo game. Cat has done bingo games. Maybe uh, you can help us out, Cat, with some information. But there's always something fun and new that you could do for your Sunday business. Throw yourself a house party. You could do that at least twice a year without being overwhelming. You could do it for, you know, the catalog um, ending both months. So, like, February, last chance, first glance. August, last chance, first glance. You have the last chance to buy whatever scents for the summer into the new catalog season. And if you do it close to the first, you know, you could take orders for both right then and there. You'll end the month good and start the month good. Um with Sensi's new catalog so you know there's ways you could plan out the months also if you've had a party recently um a party you know if you haven't done this before a party is a good place to kind of start your plan on following up with customers because you can make a list of those customers that attended the party make a few side notes of what they purchased especially in the bars that go away because then at the end of the catalog season you can say hey I know you loved Christmas Cottage um, and I know it's gonna be spring and summer but if you do want at least one more bar of Christmas Cottage we don't know if it's coming back um, order yourself a couple bars now while it's on sale because always in transition month which is February saying bye to the old stuff into the new month um, and also in August where you're saying bye to the old stuff into the new catalog season is always 10% off month okay so you could reach out to them then even if you only do it then or use those months as an opportunity to start following up stop being scared of picking up the phone and talking to people and leaving them messages um there's handy apps and i don't know what they are but i just remember this and i'm gonna have to find out for you um or you can find out for yourself because you know you do run your own business so if this is sound like if this sounds like something you want to do um there are apps that you set up on your phone and you make phone calls through the app program i don't know something like this okay the whiff of the gif of it is that you they call the number the app calls a number but it automatically takes you to their voicemail so you don't got to worry about them answering the phone in case you're scared to talk to someone so you could write out a script hey maria it's lizette with sensi i'm checking in with you because i know it's been like four months since you ordered your warmer and you probably need some new wax and i'm sorry i didn't check in with you sooner um but if you want to order it's sales month or we have this special going on or you know if you order with me um this week i'll have a free scent circle or a free surprise for you you know remember promotional per, i'm sorry personal promotional stuff that you do can't be posted you got to message them privately but you can say it in a private message you know you give them an incentive. Scent circles are cheap. They're $3. Or, you know, say I'll throw in a few samples, whatever. Whatever you could do, you don't even have to do that, okay? You really don't. Um, you could save that for a surprise if you want or just not do it at all. Um, but, you know, just reach out to them and say, you know, I would love to hear from you. Let me know. You can send me a message on Facebook or text me or... You know, if you just want to order online and not talk to me, haha, -ha, that's fine. Send into dollars.com. But um, I hope your sense is going good. Let me know if you have any questions. And um, just remember, we have a lifetime warranty and we, we have replacement parts. So if anything goes wrong or you need a light bulb, just reach out to me. 407-431-4017. You know, it doesn't have to be painful. You... Yeah. It's like people join Sensi and they act like they can't talk on the phone or talk to people. You do it all the time. You do it any, every day, any day. You talk to strangers. You give strangers attitude. Well, man up and, you know, just do the basic job duties. <clears throat> if you want to be successful with this, you want a paycheck with this. If you want your paycheck to grow with Sensi, then continue doing the things you know to do 
and find out what more you can do. Do little by little, one day at a time. Every day, try to put at least 10 minutes in your business, <coughs> whatever that means, whether if it's one day of posting or one day of writing a to-do list. You know, doing that helps you plan, helps you keep, helps keep you, you know, um, what's what I'm trying to lose? Accountable? Yeah, accountable. Sounds good. Um, and, and, you know, just planning out what you need, what you like. Do some goals. Make some sensey goals. You know, when you have events that you're going to attend, plan to have sensey on you. Don't sleep on those opportunities when you're out in public. Like I said, I don't always wear my hat, but I always have a bag. <laughs> and um, I'll have a shirt. And there's been times that I got dressed in the morning, and then I come home, and then I'm like, oh, snap, I'm going to Walmart. Let me put on my sensey shirt. You know, um, and sometimes, you know, prep being prepared doesn't always work out for you because sometimes you're prepared on the wrong day. <laughs> like it bites me in the ass when I have shit ton of sensey stuff on me and for whatever reason, nobody says anything about my purse or, you know, no one's friendly that day or. I'm just not running into people or I start to give to someone just for whatever reason I stop because now their kids spill something on them whatever the case is but then there's days where I might have rushed and didn't take that second to think okay do I have do I have any um, I do these little sample packs and I put the product sheet and the flyer of the month and a scent smell sample on my business card and I don't have anything on me I might have just left it in the car because I forgot I shouldn't leave everything in the car just because I'm running in and out. I should take my bag with me. Um, and then all of a sudden, there's all kinds of people that I will see opportunity to get something to. Uh, I wasn't ready. <laughs> and, you know, it'll backfire on you too. I remember um, when I was at the airport when me, Jessica, and Jenna went to Philly for a party. I had made, and I think I only had one on me. Uh, one of the little packets and I also had the kids color packet the kids color I don't know we have like these sheets in the family store that's like a color sheet for kids and I had crayons in there and there was a mom at the airport with a crying kid crying <laughs> and I was like here mom and I almost didn't do it at first because I was like well shit we're at the airport and I don't think you're supposed to take stuff from people at the airport but I'm like you know what? let me try and she rejected it and I was like, no, no, but take it anyway. That's because she's like, no, I have tablets, I have color. I'm like, well, here's something else. I, I should have said, and there's something for you too, you know, but I didn't do that. So I get it. She probably got freaked out that I was giving something for her kid and she didn't know me. That's fine, whatever. But um, yeah, sometimes it'll backfire, but whatever. It doesn't matter. I tried. At least I tried and... um. You know, if she would have taken it, there we go. An opportunity that she might have even joined my team, our team, right? So, you never know. But you're going to get the nose. You can't be scared of it. You can't be scared of feeling weird or, you know, however many people may have saw my reject moment. <laughs> I kept smiling. I kept talking with my girls. It was all good. Your loss. <laughs> we all know how great Sensi is, right? So, just believe in yourself and believe in that and, um... Just take it day by day and truly just try to do the little things to work your business. It's the best advice that anyone could give you if you're doing direct sales. Don't even think of it as sales. You know, again, just fall in love with the catalog. Learn as much as you can. This right here is probably the best thing. Um, get to know your sense. You know, people are going to ask you, oh, what sense should I... So get to know them. Um, you can always stick with the classics. That's a nice little tip. Because the classics are going to stick around. And I always try to get them to fall in love with at least one or two of the classic scents. Especially if they're out of town. That's, that way they're not disappointed when they're ready to order again. Okay. And when it comes to the sun of the month. Um, sorry, I got an itch right here. I think I got a bite. I was doing yard work with Eddie today. Um, especially when... Um, they fall in love with a son of the month. It's available for six months after. Okay, so 
Um, you can also make a note on your calendar to follow up with them the last month for the last chance to get, you know, Dazzling Pomegranate or Scarlet Woods or whatever we've had recently as a scent of the month. Um, and speaking of which, the warmer of the month sometimes will make the next catalog. Like this was January's warmer of the month? Yes, because I remember thinking it should have been December because it looks so wintry, but it was January's warmer of the month. I'm not mistaken. Well, I could have said that about Star Dance. Um, but yeah, just, you know, help. When you get warmers in that you've never seen before, make a video. Practice making videos. Practice talking on camera. Go to Facebook Live. Highlight that video. Don't just show it. Say something if you can. Make it personal. I mean, you could just show it. That's fine. But definitely put some of the basic info on there um, so they know what they're looking at you know what I mean um, but meeting people does not have to be hard try you know if you haven't had a launch party you know have a party introduce your friends and family to the Scentsy business that's one of the first things we tell you when you join to do a launch party oh but I don't have people in my house don't do it at your house Invite some girls out for some mojitos or freaking coffee. You know, go to the diner, have breakfast. And whip out your scentsy stuff. Again, the catalog and the scents on the most basic levels all you need. If you want to sneak in a little nightlight warmer so you could show them, you could throw that in your purse. It's not a big deal. So remember, overall, a party is an order. In Sensi Lingo, a party is an order. So if you collect 200 orders, I mean $200 in orders, that qualifies as a party. That's when you start getting free and half off Sensi. So just collect orders. Um, if you're really struggling with some of the most basic stuff or you're stuck in your head and you don't know what to do, um, talk to any of us here on the team page you know wave your hand and go okay I'm not sure what to do about this I made this team page so you can learn okay so we can support each other with the little questions with the stupid questions or the questions that feel stupid we all know that there's no such thing as a stupid question right we might feel stupid asking them but there's no such thing as a stupid question okay I hit up cat all the time with stupid questions and I realized oh shit I already knew that <laughs> you know so just remember that um that you really don't have to stress out about this business. Yes, you have three months to, to get active again. And if you didn't know this, just in case you're in a month where you already got the email from Sensi that you're gonna go inactive, you know, you don't want Sensi to fire you. <laughs> I mean, you can come back anytime, but you know, they, they keep their books with their consultants active. And they're not going to have people just to say they have 5,000 consults, 500,000, a million consultants when there's like a percentage of them that are not working their business. So there's three months to earn the $200 that you got to sell. So in January, you got to do it or February or March. It can't be 150 and 50. So in one month's time, you gotta earn, you gotta sell 200 in a month, okay? Um, that's not extremely hard to do. Is it easy to do? I'm not gonna say that easy either because everybody does things differently or everybody has their own struggles with their business. And sometimes luck, if you wanna believe in luck, but sometimes, you know, that plays a part, of, timing plays a part in it. Um, I'm gonna only try to keep this video a few more minutes, so hang in there. Um, <clears throat> you know, timing is everything. Um, if you didn't know this, uh, I remember hearing that your customers may only buy from you once or twice a year. So if there's a customer you don't talk to often enough, if they come back to you, it's only going to be once or twice a year. So you got to find a way to increase that number so your business can continue. Because it's not easy to always find new customers. So take care of the ones you have. And there's a lot of ways you could do that. 
I do mailers to remind customers that, hey, I'm still here. Um, do I mail to all my 250 customers every month? No. You know, do I uh, e uh, send them something every other month? No. I have some that I might. Um, but I, I try to rotate. If I'm sending 20 out this month, I'll try to send 20 out for the next month. You know what I'm saying? And um, I always get the flower of the month and that kind of thing. And one month I'll put the join but I always try to put a product sheet or something in there that's gonna show them the product maybe I'll switch it up and in a big envelope you know the regular big envelopes not like the, the ones that are kind of like almost this size you know what I'm talking about it's not like the standard little one like this because this is close to the size and so is this one but the bigger one and I'll fold a product sheet in half the ones that are like this size look so this will fit this will fit in one of the big ones these are the old um join flyers I still have some of these um so I do some mailers I make it fun I remind them I'm here at least to the most special customers that would buy for me a little more often I always send them something because I want them to know what's going on but every now and then I like to hit them up with a postcard or something to let them know I was thinking of them I remember last Mother's Day I didn't have time to do it this year I feel bad but last Mother's Day I sent people a Mother's Day card with no sensey info customers just so they know I was thinking about them, you know? So you try to do things that are personal and, you know, it's just a way to brand yourself and your company because this is your business. We work for Sensi, yes, but they've given us a business opportunity. And if you follow that business plan that they've laid out for you, you're going to grow and you're going to kick butt in your business. Kat is making so much money. And when I first met her, I remember me and her used to talk at night um and we used to just kind of complain about our struggles and cry about our struggles and wish things got better and easier i mean we've had some hard times as i believe you we've all had hard times in our life at one point or the other so now i i'm so proud of you cat like how well you've done over these sensi years and how much you've grown and done so many amazing i'm so proud of you i'm so happy that i'm a part of your team I'm so happy um, and I do wish I joined center uh, sooner and that's not a cliche comment anyway guys um yeah just just talk to people one person at a time don't get frustrated this is meant to be fun this is not meant to be something stressful although I know you're gonna get stressed I used to want things to happen way quicker than they did so that's another thing you get you got to practice patience in this business because we're gonna want it to grow 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 but that's not how it happens you know, you build sh one thing at a time. You know, you lay the foundation and, you know, you build and you get to your goals one step at a time. So take the steps. That's the thing. Don't not take steps. Don't just let your starter kit collect dust in the corner. Use it. Whip it out. Organize it. Have it ready. Um, you know, do what you can. If you have a room in your house that you have your own sensey space, that's awesome. Go in there and use that space. Utilize it. Um, if you don't have a lot of space, get a box, but open that box every now and then. Don't let it collect dust, okay? Because you can earn money with this business, and you will see as you start to grow, it will. You are, your eyes will open. You'll go, damn, you'll see the potential, and it's there, and it will happen. So, you know, be a little patient, but don't be so patient you don't do anything, okay? Um, I just want you guys to stick around and, and grow. Um, I'm almost three years in August. It'll be three years. And I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to quit. Um, I'm going to earn those incentive trips. And I want you guys to join me on those incentive trips. Um, I'm going to family reunion. I mean, nothing's in stone yet because I haven't signed up for everything yet. And I haven't found a plane ticket. But I'm planning to go to California, to Anaheim for Sensi Family Reunion and Kat's gonna be there and I'm gonna see Kat I'm so excited and I, I you know I hope you guys will take and you know, this is the last month to sign up for a family reunion um it's so it's gonna be so awesome and I hope you guys will think about going and if you can't make it this year I understand but I have been wanting to go to a Sensi Family Reunion now for since I've joined and um I just can't wait I can't can't wait so, 
join my I mean don't join my team that's I'm used to doing videos saying join my team you're already a part of my team so join me on the journey and um, really hop on board to earning a trip and you could do that from working your business starting now you know we have this incentive trip to Mexico going on I don't think I'm going to make it <laughs> but I'm still gonna work my business getting ready for the next incentive um, that will start August 1st or maybe September so just start doing it now plan for three months ahead do what you can ask people to join parties starting next month yeah you're busy now you're not thinking about it so start booking for the next month or the month after that you know do what you can um, you know I'm, I've struggled with booking parties but when I do book a party it is so worth it oh my god like Jessica did a party man she could but she promoted you promoted to lead so fast I mean that was pretty fast we've only been with Sensi a few months it took me a long time to get to lead um, sorry <laughs> um, and, and you know she has such a great party imagine if you do that Jessica a couple times a month a few times a month once a week what are your checks gonna look like then that's how you grow your business new customers um, again Kat she only did the travel parties the basket parties and she grew her business that way point is put yourself out there brand yourself you know however it doesn't have to be just wearing stuff but how you carry your entrepreneurship with you people are gonna see that and respect that and you're gonna be able to share it like nothing like they're missing out if they don't listen to you that's what you want to get right okay guys Team Sense into Dollars. I love you guys. Besitos to you. Sorry it was like six minutes almost over than what I was hoping to do. I actually wanted to do 20, but I knew I would go 30. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't expect to go this long. So um, if you've watched this to the end, thank you so much. Hit me up because I got something for you. You just got to let me know you saw it. Okay? Besitos to you. Bye.